talking about this baby giraffe deal. 2019 was twice as nice for a zoo in Mexico City. The most recent was unveiled last week after a mandatory quarantine period following her birth in late October. The name of the newest addition to the herd will be decided by a public vote. The first giraffe of the year was born in April there. Now, meanwhile, here at Zoo Knoxville, they have animal experiences year round, and this is a great time of year to visit. Tina Rowland is here to talk about the uh, animal encounters and the things that, that the animals do in the winter. Good to see right. you, first of all. Well, it's good to see you. Yes. Happy holidays. Um, you too. The winter really is a great time. The animals do some different things, right? It is, and, and that's what we wanted to, to make people aware of that, you know, you typically think of the, the zoo as a place you go when it's it's warm and sunny outside, but but a day like today is an amazing time to visit. Those animals are active, the, the temperatures are perfect to encourage them to be out exploring, and we go year round now. I mean, it's 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 a re, it's a full schedule from the, the time we open until the time we close. You have like the panda cubs getting they, fed and all these great experiences people can see. Yeah, you can actually see these things happening. You can see the panda cubs getting getting their lunch uh, every day. We, we give the gorilla uh, the gorilla family their lunch every day. You can watch that happening. We also have uh, almost every hour on the hour something is happening. Either a, a, an animal encounter, a, a, an opportunity to talk, to talk to the keepers that take care of those animals. Um, we've got a whole team that, that their job is to, uh, to, to make sure our guests are having great animal experiences with our animal ambassadors. So it I mean, it's not just a, a, a winter day. Uh, it's, it's, it's a full day of activity. Yeah. All right. And you also have the Kroger discount days we do. coming up, right? Talk a little bit about that, that. That is running now through February 29th. Okay. So you get $5 off every ticket. You can buy them online or when you arrive, uh, but that is compliments of Kroger. Um, the, the only thing that you really won't see this time of year are some of the tropical tortoises, um, some of those those animals that are not cold hardy. But otherwise, it is, it's a fantastic day, and, and uh, we've had... Um, lots of, of visitors and animals alike out over this, these past few days. We've had these great temperatures. All right, now say somebody wants to do a season's pass. Maybe they have some extra Christmas money and something like that. Right. Do you, what, what, you get extra perks with that, right? You do get extra perks. We like to, to say thanks because our pass holders make it possible for us to, to do our mission, which is, you know, working to save yeah. animals. Uh, a modern zoo is, is not just for animals to be on display. It is, we have a purpose. And uh, so those, those folks make that possible. And we like to give them little sneak peeks. Uh, they'll get to see some of the animals um, uh, we've got I got a new animal debuting in the spring that they'll be invited to come see first before it opens okay. to the public and other little after hours events that we do uh, just to make sure yeah. we say thank you all right and and one of our favorites is uh, George George the Gibbon yes the Gibbon uh, I don't know if we're taking this camera live right now the Gibbon cam we love showing it um, you can go to WBIR.com and see it as well as the zoo website I guess we're not taking that well right now. Georgie has been busy all day today okay uh, he is I don't know who's been interacting with whom oh, here we so. go uh, the rope is swinging around so it looks That's like a good sign that he is there for sure so um, like I said he is in constant motion and, and uh, we've been watching him um, in, interacting with our guests all afternoon and, and he he's thrilled to have the cut. there he is top right there there's goes. old George he loves that tree up there doesn't he he does he does and he loves stuffed animals so it's not unusual that you'll see him carrying around a stuffed animal while he's sitting up in the top of the tree as well. This guy is hilarious. Yeah, it's is, been a great addition, really, hasn't it? We have had so much fun with this, and it's truly changed the way our guests experience the, 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 that animal habitat because you're truly immersed, 360 degrees. Um, he might be above you, he might be below you, he yeah. might be eye to eye, but you're truly on a multi-level um, circular habitat that he that he is constantly moving through with his um, companion Malay. So we we have been really pleased that yeah. that we can change the way not only the the habitats that we provide our animals and the care we can provide them, but just the way our guests get to. It's a terrific zoo. It.